Alright, so it is Monday, week 2, uh, 7.17. Didn't see our schedule for this week. So I don't know if the vice principal was just behind or what. But there should be an electronic copy, so... The reason why I'm saying that is because they want us to do star testing, but we need to know if we have any extra enrichment activity. So, yeah. Also, I was trying to figure out if I've been to the school before and I have, and I was a substitute, <laughs> and actually the vice principal remembered, and that was more than four years ago. Though. <laughs> it was just one day. So. I'm surprised that she remembered. <laughs> and I did see my vice principal. Uh, I don't know exactly what her role is, but yeah. although we do have pre-K in my school is the one that has a pre-K out of the three schools, so she might be here because of that. And pre-K is like all day. <laughs> And they're also doing a summer camp at the same time. But, yeah. At the at the school through the YMCA. So some of our students actually have to go to the YMCA in Athens. <laughs> but, uh, I will check in with you guys probably this afternoon after dismissal. All right. So it is Tuesday morning. I wasn't able to vlog yesterday afternoon because one of the buses was late. I think it was the best that that had my home school student. So, and yesterday, one of the one of my students was waiting for that bus, but since only had one left, the counselor's like, I could go and she would watch her or whatever. But by the time that I left, which was at 12:30, they were still waiting for the bus. So. <laughs> and I guess. They thought it was going to be arriving shortly because she's like, oh, they said it's 20 minutes late, so that means they should be here in five minutes. No. <laughs> and so I think we had a total of four students yesterday, four regular students, because there, there are other students on our roster who just haven't been here. So. Yeah. But today, we're going to be doing star reading, so hopefully that goes well. <laughs> the PE teacher basically... Uh, done last week was his last week which is a little weird because <laughs> it wasn't like in the middle between the two sessions was already to start the second session but apparently he's going to be teaching in a different district so they still let him teach part of summer school which is interesting I, don't know. I was wondering about that but I guess they do allow that <laughs> If I move next year, I would have already left like, right around the time summer school would start. I would be in the process of moving. So. If I can, I would check in with you guys this afternoon. Otherwise, I'll just see you guys tomorrow. I got here before the vice principal, so we'll have to go back up to the front to get my roster because it wasn't out. So, yeah, I will see you guys later. Alright, so it is 12.03 bus was on time today <laughs> um we had two two students out i'm not counting that one student that hasn't shown up since the past monday i guess he's just done with camp so yeah so we had two my all of my students were here had issues with star testing um it seemed like only the student that go to this school could do it and then students from the other group couldn't it had something to do with we had to put in the password as admin or monitor and it wouldn't work for students from the other school so the person reset it so i think we're going to be doing math but then thursday will have to be a makeup day and then tomorrow they also have botanical gardens so they're going to be gone for a while they'll basically only be able to do math 
start test and then botanical gardens special <laughs> That's it. yeah started planning for next unit i'm gonna be doing this book um we do have a math thing but it don't seem like we use it that much um i'm basically just gonna be doing what they have in here for that book because they have a couple of activities and then next week is supposed to be spirit week so i guess they get to dress up in certain things and then the teacher my co-teacher basically was saying she would like to do something special for the last day next week we just have to figure out something but yeah, i don't know if they would let us do pizza but if not maybe like popsicles or something i don't know <laughs> but yeah otherwise it was a besides the testing not working it was okay Tonight, I need to go to the gym. I thought I set my alarm, but I didn't. <laughs> so, I'm gonna go this afternoon. Then I'm gonna have to come back, do some studying, rebraid my hair after class. It's gonna need to be rebraided. But that is gonna be it for today oh tomorrow's payday yay <laughs> i think that i might switch one of my korean classes like take it from a different place because it's part of a network of whatever is it the one that i have tonight the actual center is located in California so the time difference is a little late especially when school starts back up because it's from 7 to 9 for my time I'm like, mm. <laughs> that's a little the one I had yesterday was from 6 to 7 30 I'm like that's the opal but 7 to 8 or 7 to 9 is pretty late for me so I've been looking and I think I found one a place that East Coast time. <laughs> so that won't be till like maybe September. Or the registration would be in August. So. And I signed up for contact with whenever they release the classes for the next term. But that is going to be it for today. I will talk with you guys tomorrow. Good morning. It's 7:19. Wednesday, last day of the month, yeah, but I need to do star math today. Everything should be working fine today because the district just reset the password or the monitor password. So it should be the same, allegedly. <laughs> I guess we'll find out today. But it needs to work because it closes tomorrow and we need to do make up for reading because we weren't able to do it so this week to me is going by slow like it's only Wednesday <laughs> I'm so tired uh, I'm exhausted uh, one more week and then three weeks of being able to sleep in I really wish that I was able to do it the first three weeks because I knew this would happen that I would just Super tired. Yeah. So basically, all the students are going to have time to do today is the star test thing because at oh, I'm looking at the wrong camera at ten. Well, mm, they might have like thirty. No, oh, it depends because it's math. So it could take them a while, but they're working out the problem. I might go find something they can do. Uh, she did say that we have 
something on read work. Like they set up on read work, but I might just buy something from a practice book. Like this. <laughs> and then to work on. And the teacher said she wanted to do something special for the students for next week, so we might be doing like a hot dog and chips and stuff because our theme is camping. But I will check in with you guys later this afternoon. Alright, afternoon. We had three students out, but it was from the other group. Um, testing worked, so. And we were able to do reading for the ones who missed it yesterday. We just have to do math for the three that were out and one of them we also have to do reading tomorrow we do have one thing like first thing in the morning then we have like a good hour so tomorrow i'm gonna get like 30 minutes so i'm looking um let's see what we could do in 30 minutes because i don't want to start a whole nother book because that's going to take way more than 30 minutes so. I've been doing some research, looking at districts for next school year, like based off what step I think I'll be at, whatever that pay is, comparing them. So, definitely, obviously, the ones more in the actual city of Atlanta pay better <laughs> than others, but there's a couple of different ones. All of them pay more than what my current district pays. So. I'm like, I don't even have to live in the city. I could just work in the city and live outside of it if I wanted to. Most of them also have a bonus for special ed teacher. So. But I am exhausted, so tired. I got some studying to do. I have homework for one of my classes, um, mainly on Seesaw. One of them is recording us reading something in Korean. <laughs> on top of the other normal studying that I do. The, hopefully I can go to sleep early tonight. We'll see. But that is going to be it for today. I will check in with the guests tomorrow. All right, so it is Thursday, 7-19, last day for this week. Hopefully today will go by quickly. I do have a couple of students who need to do math star. Uh, I don't know how we're going to do that. And I actually got up and went to the gym this morning. Uh, didn't have as much time as I would have liked, but better than none. And then tomorrow I can spend a good amount of time there because I don't have anything tomorrow. That's going to be it for now. I will check in with you guys uh, this afternoon. Alright, it is 12.04. Just finished taking my students. Well, all of my students just got on the bus. And now uh, I need to fill out my timesheet, but I can't submit it until exactly 12.30. Uh, yeah, but today was a decent day. Three students were absent. At first it was four, but one of them ended up coming late. Um, two of mine were out. Yeah, and then we had this little activity. It did last as long as it said it would. Uh, there's some guy named Dave Holland. I don't know if he's like part of a company or something, but basically he uses music, but using like instruments that you can make out of different materials. Um, and I guess it also incorporates some science stuff. So that was interesting and fun. <laughs> it was pretty cool. Yeah. And then that was basically it. We didn't, well, for reading, we just did like this little Jeopardy game with synonyms and antonyms. And then they went over the value of coins and math, and then they had specials and then came back we had like 20 minutes left so um a lot of times in afternoon we let them listen to a read aloud one of the books because the other teacher her she said her favorite author is Patricia Palaco or whatever <laughs> so 
which is a different story about cyber, I don't remember the name, but it's about cyberbullying. Yeah. I'm just gonna go ahead and pre-fill out the form so I can submit it right at 12.30 so we can leave. <laughs> and that was it. Next week's the last week, but Tuesday through Friday. <sighs> yeah. Don't really have any plans for the rest of this weekend. Sleep in, go to the gym Friday, um, go to the store, because we are planning like a little special treat for next Friday, so I do need to get some things for that. Um, that's about it. Besides studying Korean. But, yeah. That's it for this week's vlog. Week two of summer school is done. One more week and then three weeks rest which i'm looking forward to <laughs> doing nothing thank you guys for watching i will see you in my next video